I recently did a reaction to Ryan and so many of you in the comments said I had to look at this collaboration Man. between him and Chinchilla and I haven't heard it before. I cried last time so we'll see. <laughs> I hope I don't cry that much this time. If you're interested to hear what I sound like when I sing, I have just made a cover of Wicked Game by Chris Isaac. It is out here on YouTube, also on Spotify and Apple, and I would love to hear what you think about it. So I'm not sure, but most of these performances are live performances, so one to three takes I think is basically what, maybe vocally one take and visually a few. He has such a warm tone in this. We didn't hear much of his singing when I, I did a reaction before. It was more rapping and one, his lyrics are phenomenal. What a, what a lyricist. Really, really beautiful. Really, it really evokes a lot of emotions and there's some beautiful wordplay and metaphors within it. But here, the warmth of his voice, the strength of his voice, if I'm being technical, I don't know if he even knows he's doing this, but if he's being technical, he's getting full chord closure, his vocal cords are meeting fully so that you're getting a really rich and resonant tone and he's in this really echoey space. I don't know if they've put some reverb on after, but I, th I think it might just be the space, you know. And then he's adding some really, really wobbly vibrato, which gives it a, a solely edge. Beautiful. But little by little, bit by bit. Nice mix. I'm pushing Quite back heavy, but with a new habit. If not for long, just for a while. I'll bury myself with a great big smile. Oh mama, oh mama. We trace ourselves in the chalk outlines. Oh my. Horror movie vibes. So truly, and the sip of serotonin. Don't cry, cause there's a pill for everything. Those nails are scary, but also her voice is beautiful. I love hers, is a smoother tone. She's actually allowing a little bit of breath through on some of it. Na, na, the higher notes na, 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 na. now this is partially because of where it sits in her voice as opposed to his voice it's sitting a little bit higher in his range so he's having to um maintain a mix more whereas it's more towards her chest voice although a little bit in, into her mix as well at the top there so 
it kind of just sits differently in a female and male voice, even though I think that she's probably an, a mezzo alto and he's a tenor, so they're not that different in range, but it still does. It makes a difference. Take this one, wash it down and you'll be fine. I think she was hiding there the whole time. I think so. So it goes like Nice how they're matching the vibrato. I'm balanced on my toes so I can breathe. Sometimes. So there's some match of vibrato there. They're, they've got similar vibrato speech, which is really, really nice. Although I'm breathe. He did a straight and she did breathe with a vibrato the whole way. And it is interesting because I always think you can tell when people, how much people sing together. I think they sing together quite a lot or enough that they have got the vibe of the phrasing together. So the phrasing is really strong, but they haven't got the thing like, if you hear a first aid kit, their siblings, their voices are like, like they are meant to be they're just the same and all their phrasing and all their uh the vibrato is just so spot on because they've been singing together since they were like babies you know whereas here you've got the separation between two different people and that's not necessarily a bad thing because that tells a different story that is telling like two different people's perspectives and i i don't that could be a choice as well sometimes it's nice to have these two different perspectives and two people looking at the same thing from different angles but Just little by friend. little bit by bit i'm pushing back down with a new habit if not for long a really hard line for both of them <laughs> because you're going over your register break and they wanted that lighter breathy whoo, ethereal drop off at the top but it's really easy to get a yodel there so just slowly ease up over your register break kind of go from that heavier space seem like you're crescendoing and come back into that mix is really really tough and they both did it in equally tough parts of their range because of the harmony that they're in at the same time and it was really really beautiful. I also want to go back to that previous point that I said about them being like two different people and what it makes me feel like is like you know when you meet someone who really understands what you're going through you meet a friend for the first time and you're sitting there and you're like have you had to deal with this? Oh, me too. And you're just talking about that experience and you you have so much in common, but you're still, you know, separate humans who've come together later in life. That's what it feels like because of the way that they're working their harmonies. Interesting, right? It's such a perfect day. Take it just in case. Take it just in case. I'm scared of being okay. What a lyric. It's such a perfect day. It's a beautiful shade. It's a beautiful shade. I'm scared of being okay. Cause all things change. But little by little, bit by bit. I'll push it back down with a new habit If not for long, just for a while I'll bury myself so with a great big smile Oh my mind, oh my mind We trace my ourselves in these chalk outlines Oh my mind, oh my mind That's tough Wow. I normally clap at the end, but again, 
another song by Ren that has made me be like, oh, oh my goodness. And um, I loved how it raised up into this big kind of raw place. It, it kind of had messiness. It wasn't perfect. You got that real feeling of live music, which was wonderful. And, and, ha and kind of ripping apart as you are stressing out about the trust and that you have to place, the faith that you have to have by kind of taking pills to help you get through um, anxiety, I suppose. And the way that she hit those high notes at the top, well, one that's brilliant technique, brilliant mix, but it also just really, really, from both of them, it expressed almost a scream of help. <laughs> help me. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please do like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one.